Hi everyone, today's video we're gonna throw it back to what I consider to be like a classic YouTube video and that's a what's in my bag video. This was one of the first videos I ever filmed on my channel. I think I've even filmed a video with this exact bag before. Whatever, you know, it's one of my favorites. I like to pull it out around now, fall, Christmas, because it's bright red and I feel like it, it works for the season. It's a Vera Bradley turnkey satchel and it's really nice because it is machine washable, so if it gets kind of grody, you can chuck it in the uh, washing machine and it's all better. And it's just um, just a good bag. I really love Vera Bradley. I think they make really good stuff. So first I have my phone. It wasn't in my bag, but I put, I usually keep my phone. There's this little outside pocket right here. Um, and that's pretty much all I keep in it is my phone. I'll show you all this. I think this is really cute. Uh, we went on a hike the other day, and that's John, my boyfriend, and Hippo and Kanga. I really like that. Um, I have a little Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer. I use it a lot. Um, you know, I don't want to get sick. And it's got a little bitty sheet, which I think is really cute. And then we'll just open it up and see what's in here. I have a set of orange gloves. I just like to have um, a set of gloves because it's really, really cold here already. And I've been told by many people that you need to have a set of gloves that you um, ice scrape with and then another set of gloves in your cars that you actually wear because these will get soaked. So I've just been wearing those. Um, my purse usually stays downstairs, which is where we walk the dogs too. So if it's really cold in the morning, I walk the dogs with the gloves on. Oh yeah, there's this. Um, this is my Fitbit. I've done a full review of my Fitbit Alta. You can tell by my super awesome tan line that I love it and I wear it all the time. But my band just broke and this would be too small. So I've ordered a new band. Um, that band was from Target. It was a set of three for $20 and I've had it pretty much as long as I've had my Fitbit. So like almost two years. So I feel like it, I got my money's worth out of it for sure. Um, I didn't keep any of the other bands just cause I never used them. I always liked this one. So I have ordered a new band and I'll be getting that soon. Um, I have a coffee mug and spoon in my purse. I usually bring my coffee mug once a week. And I use it all week in school. Um, this one's got Captain Hook and Skull Rock with Mr. Smee. Um, and then on Monday, I take it home because I go to my small group where we drink hot tea. And I just bring my own mug. And I also have my spoon. Um, these are really cool. Uh, I think they're cool. They have little echinoderms on them. So that's like a um, sand dollar and a sea star. And that this is not an echinoderm. It was like a little like snail shell. I just really like them. Um, last night, I did not go to small group because I've been feeling really sick. Um, so I just didn't go to small group, but I left it in my purse anyway. Uh, here's the wallet that goes with the purse. I don't really have anything very exciting. Oh, I do have this. This, to me, is kind of funny. Um, so, Jasmine, if you don't know, is my all-time favorite Disney princess. And at Disney World, if you actually go to like uh, the World of Disney, the giant one in Disney Springs in Orlando, they have like every princess or every character really you could imagine on a gift card. Now my mom has one that has Paul McCartney's face on it that she got like over 10 years ago at Starbucks. And so I've been envious of that for a long time. And we saw this one and I put it in John's pocket and uh, we took it. Uh, that's not the most honest thing to do. It is a gift card. I could have just put some money on it, but I didn't. I'm not going to be honest with you, um, but I love it. It's really beautiful. Then we've just got credit cards. Nothing very exciting there. I actually have some cash, which I never had cash. I've got 20 whole dollars. I'm rich. Some other cards. Nothing overly exciting, but I do like this wallet. And I like that it opens all the way up, so it gets like completely flat. So it's really easy to see, um, and you can fit a lot of stuff in it. So I'm really a big fan. I have my mints. I, I like Altoids wintergreen flavor. Kanga's shivering. She's really cold. Um, the tin I got actually at Universal Studios from um, the Harry Potter world. It's tooth splintering strong mints. Um, I got it at Weasley Wizard Wheezes. I just thought it was really cute. So I just transfer Altoids into that because it makes me happy. Um, I was at a conference this weekend. Uh, the Sensorium at Purdue University. I made lots of notes about different people's projects that I was interested in or that I felt like was relevant to my thesis. Those are the posters. Um, so yeah, if I felt like it, or my dissertation. Technically I'm writing a dissertation now on a thesis. So I just wrote stuff like that. I need to keep that. My sunglass case, it's also Vera Bradley. Um, I had a pair of Costa aviators that I was obsessed with and I lost them on a cruise, which was really upsetting. So I got these. These I think are by, who are they by like J-Lo? I think so. I don't know, they have little rocks. 
I think they're cute. Um, I don't like them as much as my coast does, but aviators that I feel like are cheaper, I feel like just a really, really um, flimsy. These feel pretty nice. Uh, they work, so that's what I've been using recently. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, I have my clean straws. Uh, you can see that they're labeled clean straws. I also have a dirty straw bag in here. Um, I try very hard not to use straws, but I like straws. Um, I prefer to use a straw when I have a soda, but it's not good for the environment. So I just bring my own straw. We got these at the Toledo Zoo. They have cute little animals on them. We've got some plain ones in there as well. Um, so whenever John and I go anywhere, if I go somewhere with my friends, I provide straws to anyone that would like one because it's better for the environment. And I'm not the best about that, but I try to be good. Um, a little first aid kit. It's got a lot of band-aids in it, mainly. Oh, you can't even see that. Uh, they have Mickey Mouse heads on them, which is always fun. I, I feel like they're really good, especially if you wear those shoes, you know, like ballet flats, and they give you a blister, put on a band-aid. Um, I just kind of use them for whatever. This is a Zycam bottle that's empty. I usually in here have uh, things for acid reflux. Papaya enzyme, it's like a natural remedy for acid reflux and for like digestion, because um, I do get kind of bad acid reflux. Mainly it's because of stress, so it doesn't help that much, but it helps a little. Here's my car key. I drive a Ford Fiesta, and it's got a UF Vet School little tag on it. Um, I wanted to be a vet. I'm not anymore. I'm kind of over that. But I did want to be a vet for a really long time in my life. Um, so, yeah. And I went to UF for undergrad, if you did not know. Oh, this is cute. This is my little, like, pocket watch. But I got it when I graduated from my master's. Which one is it? I can't remember. But it's, like, supposed to look like a little bitty crab. He's got his little legs out. So, um, he's cute. I don't know. Or not pocket watch. Did I call it that? Pocket knife. It's got lots of little goodies in there. I feel like if I ever need them, I have them. Uh, this is Advil and it has some charcoal because I was told that would help my acid reflux. So there's some charcoal in there. I don't think that's helped that much. So, whatever. Ooh, this is good. This is some um, hand lotion. It's by the brand Dionys, Dionys Goat Milk Skin Care. I'm not sure, but it works really well and I do enjoy it. <coughs> oh, that's the broken piece of um, my Fitbit. This is my little notebook. We're supposed to write down anytime we have like a moral issue for um, my advisor. We write them down or it's kind of like a journaly thing. Um, I don't know, I'm not the best about, I like the idea of journaling, but I'm really not the best at doing it. I'm also gonna write my sister's vows in here because it's a pretty book and it kind of goes with her color scheme. Um, so I'm gonna write my sister's vows in here as well. Here's my pencil bag, because I am a forever student. Uh, I've got nothing super exciting pencils. Oh, this one's cute. Uh, it's a little zero pen, I got it for Halloween. Um, we've got some highlighters in here, some other just generic pens and pencils. You know, gotta have my supplies. And this bag came from Lily Pulitzer. Um, I really like it, I've had it since I was an undergrad. Um, I want to say I got it my junior or senior year, but so I've had it for like four or five years and I felt like it still looks pretty brand new. Oh, and here's my chapstick. It's from Lasting Smiles. I think I got it in like an empty bag. Okay. Oh, I have my compact. I got this when I ordered the Elsa and Anna makeup from Mally. Uh, it's just a little compact, nothing super exciting. They had at... Um, box lunch they had a jasmine one and i really wanted to buy it but john said i didn't need it and he was right sometimes he tells me no uh and yeah that's pretty much it so you can see the inside has a different pattern we've got like your secret compartment where you put your lady things well i don't know maybe other people put stuff other stuff that's what i always put in it and then you've got three little pockets i try to keep stuff in those pockets like that's where my compact was i usually try to keep chapstick and lip uh chip chapstick and hand lotion in there and then like my Advil um but usually you know like with any person it always like gets scattered all about but yeah that's what I keep in my bag uh I don't know if any of that was very exciting but it's what's in there so I hope you enjoyed this video I think these are fun kind of gives you I don't know maybe a little bit more of a sneak peek into my life if you will I don't know that my life is that exciting but it, it's what it is I enjoy it so yeah as always if you have any questions requests suggestions or comments go ahead and leave those down below and I'll just see y'all real soon bye